before showing you a very interesting expansion of a table which we did YouTube a while ago which is end of days 5776 one can see it a while ago but now with the appearance what they say about Nibiru and Purim amazingly we found some additional interesting thing so before showing you the additional thing let us see the introduction that we did at that time on the table and then we see the additional one what you are going to see now is the expansion of this table. So what you see here is the following. You can see here what we saw in the old one definitely, which was the appearance of A5000 Tafshin Ein Vav 776. Imagine it come in few verses in the book of Genesis. You can see only 50 letters in a line, which itself is very important. 50 represent 50 gates of understanding and 50 days of beauty and all have to do also with the courts as we saw in other tables. What we have here, as we saw last time, as we said, eight Tavshina and Vav, and we had the Ben Ishai, the son of Jesse, 
is David an important thing so the recovery before the Pony Bach it in the end of days. Then we saw the also parallel the word Mashiach, Benishai. Now after seeing so many things connecting Nibiro with Purim, amazing we found here Nibiro wearing small skip of Purim. And also Bnei Yosef, the children of Yosef, going to Kabbalah. Esther, you have Esther, is connected with the Messiah and Yosef, the son of Joseph, Mishael Ben Yosef. Amazing coming Esther, Purim. Then you have Ephraim, which is really Mashiach Ben Yosef also. Then the most interesting, after finding a bureau, we found here the word Kochab, but on the same skip. Meteor, you can see Meteor, amazing, Meteor on the same skip, Meteor, Kochav, Nibiru, amazingly showing some connection with Nibiru and also Meteor. So all together are very, very interesting table, and as always we say that <coughs> even the time is very appropriate for coming from Mashiach and Elijah, which comes here also, we need repentance, Shuvah. So let us hope that we'll do it and we'll have Messiah coming soon in Purim and we'll have peace and quiet all over the world.